So I am back with another 5 amazing secret legendary weapon locations. Now let's not hang about and get straight into it people. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. Also guys, due to the amazing support you've been showing me on this game, I'm giving you guys the chance to win any game of your choice. To be in with a chance of winning this, simply drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed. And good luck everybody. So first and foremost, welcome to all the newcomers to this game who arrived over the Xmas period. I do want to make everyone feel welcome here and it's why I plan on covering every hidden weapon location, some newly found, others old, just so I can cover a basis for all players, new and old. So today guys, we check out 5 legendary weapons you can get quite easily. Some require a little staff, a couple of fists, a few bullets and others require nothing but your legs. So let's get into it. And first up guys we have the prototype, Shinjen Mark V. So this SMG can be located at the back of a truck within the Arizaka Industrial Park. I mean if you are quick enough you can just run in and grab this thing, otherwise you will have a fight on your hands. It's location you can see on the screen now, so go and get it people. Next up we have the Overture Power Revolver. To be honest for me it seems a little inaccurate but in the right hand and if this is your kind of thing with the correct mods applied this thing is an absolute beast. It's located in a spot where you do need to take out a few enemies but nothing too hard here at all. Next up guys we have the Nawaki, which is one of the better design weapons I have seen. I mean I do love this thing. Now this burst power assault rifle you can see the location to on screen now. It does require you to take out a few enemies, although in the video I've already cleared them out to make it as short as possible for you. So yes, go and get these people. Next up guys we have the M2038 Tactician which is obviously a shotgun. This one probably the easiest to get from today's video and although it can appear as an epic version, if you create a manual save before picking it up and load that save back up and keep doing it until it turns orange, you land yourself quite a decent legendary shotgun here. So do what you gotta do people and go get this thing.
Make it quick! No mercy! And lastly for today's video guys, we have the electric Baton Alpha Melee Weapon. Weird thing about this one is the fact that there are two of the same weapon in the same place. Sometimes one can appear as an epic, but I got two legendaries. This one is part of a side mission called An Inconvenient Killer. Do as I do, follow the path I take and go get this thing guys. If by some unfortunate chance it appears as an epic for you, you can create a manual save here before picking up the weapon and keep loading that save until it becomes a legendary. And there we have it people, 5 amazing legendaries you don't want to miss out on. So go get them people. Guys stay tuned as I'm going to bring many many other top 5 secret weapon and item locations. So if that's what you want to see and you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. But guys the end of the video has arrived, if you enjoyed it leaving a like really helps out. And hopefully guys I will see you on that next one. Whoa! Think fleas like you just get in for free? Hear me out, Chum. I'm hitting up NC's Primus joints for some fresh XBD talent. Chicks and fellas who aren't afraid to show a little skin for some quick and easy eddies, you follow? Not interested. Oh, you're about to be. For every actor comes out with me, you get 10% of their fee. Guaranteed eddies, zero risk. What do you say? You in or out? Huh. Alright, fine. Go ahead. Sweet Jesus. You hear that? Do you hear what they're playing? Each to their own, Johnny. That's what peeps with bad taste always say. Don't know what he did to deserve what's coming, but his music taste is reason enough to trot.